What is up everyone? Welcome to today's reaction video and today's reaction is the winner of this week's poll for other artists over on my Patreon and it was Peter Holland, specifically his epic Christmas movie medley and I could not be more excited for this one. Not just because it's part of our Christmas season of reactions, we're wearing the Merry Shrekmas shirt today, but on top of that, it is, I have just now realized as I brought the video up that it is his epic Christmas movie medley featuring Brian Hull, who I don't know, but I can't wait to hear, and Jeff freaking Castellucci. I am so excited. And on top of that, cherries on the cake, I can already see just from looking at the video that we are also going to be getting the amazing Miss Evelyn Hollands and the adorable Ashlyn Hollands. I cannot wait for this. To say I'm excited is an understatement. We have someone dressed up as the Grinch down the bottom and I, I am ready. I am so keen. I'm so pumped. We're going to get into this. As always, please check out the original video linked in the description below. Give it a like, give it a comment, subscribe to Peter if you haven't already, because if you don't know it, you're going to know by the end of the video, he so deserves it. So please go and subscribe. We're going to get into this. This is Peter Hollands featuring Brian Hull and Jeff Castellucci in his epic Christmas movie medley. Let's go. I know. You know Ralphie and Kevin. You know Ralphie and Kevin and Frosty and Buddy. Snow Miser, Heap Miser, Charlie and Grinchy. But oh my you... god, I've just realized they've changed it to be the names of different movie characters. Okay, okay, straight off straight off the bat here. Kevin, Kevin McAllister. Know him right away. Ralphie. Ralphie I'm not too sure about. Frosty, Frosty the Snowman. Never actually seen it, but I know Frosty the Snowman. Rudolph, again, Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Who doesn't know the character, but I haven't actually seen the Rudolph movie. Buddy and Jovi, that's Elf. I know that. Grinchy, the Grinch, Snowmeister and Heatmeister, everyone's heard the song, but I don't know the uh, the movie again, uh, and I'm not sure who the last one, uh, Snoopy, I think that's from Snoopy's Christmas special, possibly, but yes, I either way, let's go. Miser Charlie and Grinchy. Yeah, Charlie Brown, that's the one, uh, Charlie Brown Christmas special, but yes, again, don't know, haven't seen it, don't know the song from it, but let's go. Snow Miser, Heap Miser, Charlie and Grinchy. But do you recall the best Christmas movie of all? Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer, reindeer. had a very shiny nose. He sure did. And if you ever saw it, saw it. you would even say it glows. Like a light bulb. That, I, I am never going to get over in these. I've, I've reacted to a couple of, I, I think I saw him for the first time recently in my reaction to A Million Dreams. And I was not at all for 1% of the time ready for how freaking adorable Ashland is. And now seeing him in this, when he came in with the, uh, what was the line he said? Very name? shiny no. He sure did. <laughs> the he sure did. That is just the cutest thing ever. This kid has so much personality and so much talent. The Christmas season on my channel is just bringing out all these talented kids and I can't handle it. I'm loving it so much. Red nose reindeer, reindeer had a very shiny nose. He sure did. And if you ever saw it, saw it, you would even say it glows. Like a light bulb. Hmm, look what you did, you little jerk. Uh, Dreaming of a white Christmas Just like the ones I used to know I was wondering how he was going to do uh, Home Alone and I'd completely forgotten this song was in there and the whole scene where he has the hair slicked back and he's wearing the robe. Perfect. Perfect portrayal. Peter is so, so good when he does these medleys because he captures each thing that he's doing so brilliantly. Just like the ones I used to know Where the treats 
talks glisten and children listen to hear sleigh bells in the snow the snow I love how he finishes it with the aftershave because that moment is just so good. Uh, I also, I, I have to comment on it because I know people are going to say about it in the comments. Yes, I have watched Home Alone my whole life. Did I know that the White Christmas song from that was made famous by Bing, Cros by Bing Crosby? Crosby, not Cosby, Crosby. No, I did not. If you saw my Bing Crosby reaction earlier in the week, I had no idea who he was. I now know that the man is basically, oh, I don't know, the voice of Christmas. That every Christmas carol you've heard through pretty much your entire life, including the original, uh, well, the, the version I grew up with of Little Drummer Boy, was him. Uh, again, I said at the start of the video that I didn't think I knew him, but I probably knew his songs. I just didn't know the name. And that's exactly what it is. I've been hearing this man my whole life and had no idea. But anyway, back to this reaction. Oh, the snow. The snow. The snow. I can't handle it. Oh my god. Why aren't my brothers that cute? My brothers just fight things and yell all the time. He's adorable. Um, Honestly, the cutest kid ever. And like I said in the last video, I said in a million dreams reaction, these are like legitimately like core memories that they are making. <laughs> like they, they, the time they are spending making these, they will look back on for the rest of their lives. And I love that so much. It makes it so, so special. Also, I'm just now trying to think if uh, A Million Dreams went on the main channel or if it's currently on my uh, Patreon only and my YouTube members. But if you're wondering where I did Million Dreams and it's not on the main channel, that's where it is. So check those out. Let's get going. A pipe and a button nose and two eyes made out of coal. Frosty the snowman. The commitment to the bit of oh, rah, 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 into the pasta. No one can say this man is not dedicated to his craft because that looks like real pasta with real candy through it. And uh, after a long day of filming, I can't imagine that that's fresh out of the cooking pot. So commitment to the bit. I give you praise, Peter. Um, also, the costumes throughout this whole thing are hilarious. I love that his hat is just paper duct taped to his head. I love that so much. Uh, but I can't get over how good Evelyn's voice is. She is just incredible. I really can't but stay. But baby, it's cold outside. I've got to go but away. But baby, it's cold. <laughs> this evening has been that you so in. very nice. I'll hold your hands, they're just like My mother I. will start to worry. My father will be pacing the floor. Listen to the fireplace roll. I really can't stay. I know, I know there are some people out there that like have, I don't know if you go as far as to call it a phobia, but a definite hatred of seeing people eat. And that's a whole thing right there. Some people just got traumatized by this film clip with the way that Peter was eating there. My God, man, take a breath. Uh, but yeah, I've got, I've got to put it out there. I've got to put it out there. I know in 2023, the lyrics to Baby It's Cold Outside are problematic at best. It is it is a problematic song if you take it the wrong way. But it is still an absolute Christmas bop. Probably one of my favourite Christmas carols just for the, the call and response style of it. I love it so much. And I know there's been other versions that have been put together that have been done so well where it's like updated lyrics so that it's not as uh, rapey vibes for lack of a better term. But yeah, uh, I, I 
it's still one of my favorite Christmas songs just for the way the two voices work together and kind of just slightly overlap one another. It's just done gorgeously. Christmas time. I, little kids, man, little kids being able to get their voices up that high. Nuts. Absolutely crazy. Uh, I feel like there might've been some more mixing on that one there than there was on the other ones. It just, how it hit my ear, it might've been, but I love that if we go back, if you watch the Grinch during this, he's like clamping his hands over these ears. He have, he's having none of these Christmas carols and I love it. It's the first time I picked up on it. Also have to comment on the fact that for Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer, Peter Hollins is dressed up as a reindeer. Therefore, he is herd confirmed. Peter Hollins is a member of the herd. It's confirmed. Fun for all that children call their favorite time of year. It's my favorite too. You know why? I'm Mr. White Christmas. I'm Mr. Snow. <laughs> I'm Mr. Icicle. I'm Mr. Ten Below. <laughs> Friends call me Snow Miser. What? I'm sorry. Did they just replace Peter in the elf scene with an actual inflatable doll of Will Ferrell from Elf? Ten Below. Friends call me Snow. It's literally the Santa's coming moment. I love that so much. Peter Holland's comedy just hits right. Oh, miser, whatever I touch turns to snow in my clutch. <laughs> I'm too much. I'm Mr. Green Christmas. I'm Mr. Sun. He's Mr. Sun. I'm Mr. Heat Blister. I'm Mr. 101. Ah, they call me Heat Miser. Whatever I touch. <laughs> I'm too much. Okay, Brian Hull is amazing. Absolutely amazing. Jeez Louise. Not only did his vocals sound incredible, but the character that he had in his voice then. Holy jeez Louise. Listen to that last bit. Me heat, miser, whatever I touch. Starts to melt in my clutch. <laughs> I'm too much. I'm trying to think of what character it sounds like, but I've seen characters that sounding the laugh almost gave me like Pete from the Mickey Mouse cartoons. It almost gave me those vibes. But regardless, he has such a, I hope he does voice work because if he doesn't, it's a wasted talent. He has the voice for it, but also he can sang. Cool down, buddy, and get a load of someone who's really too much. You're a mean one, Mr. Grinch. You really are a heel. Oh my God, I cannot, I cannot handle a Jeff Castellucci version of You're a Mean One, Mr. Grinch. Uh, I, I am secretly, not secretly at all, I am basically at this point campaigning and praying that on Christmas Eve, I get to react to the voice play version of You're a Mean One, Mr. Grinch because I will die. But having this as a teaser is too much. I, I, a part of my brain was so sure that it was going to be Jeff to do your mean one, Mr. Grinch. And yeah, I, I, I am not, I'm not going to handle this at all. Am I? Let's go. Let's, let's just, I don't even have my base fan. I've put it away at the moment and I'm not okay. You really are a heel. You're as cuddly as a cactus. You're as charming as an eel, Mr. Grinch. You're a bad banana with a greasy black beard. Okay, Jeff. Oh my God. If we get 1% of that through the freaking voice play version, it's going to kill me. But oh my God. First, again, I have to comment on Peter Hollins's commitment to the bit. Not only with him walking through and doing the burps and the farts and everything like that. And the other versions of him reacting to it in perfect timing. Brilliant. 
but the man is eating a banana peel down the bottom of the screen. If he's not eating it, he's at least putting the whole thing in his mouth, and that's more than I'd be willing to do for my craft. It, it will take a lot of campaigning for y'all to get me to put a banana skin in my mouth on the camera. It ain't happening. That is commitment to the bit. But that last note from Jeff, oh my God. I'm greasy black Come on. You're a monster, Mr. Grinch. Your heart's an empty hole. The green fighters. You've got garlic in your soul, Mr. Grinch. I wouldn't touch you with a 39 and a half foot pole. You better watch out. You better not cry. You better not pout, because you'll shoot your eye out. Santa Claus is coming to town. Ugh, I hate that guy. He's making a list, he's checking it twice. He's gonna find out who's naughty or nice. Santa Claus is coming to town. I'm still not too sure who that, what, what movie that one's from. This could be the miracle on something or another street that I've never seen in my whole life. I know that's apparently an abomination that I haven't seen that, but that's all I can think that it might be from. I'm not sure. Either way, uh, everyone knows this song. I love this song and Evelyn is killing it as we knew she would. You're nice. Santa Claus is coming to town. He sees you when you're sleeping. He knows when you're awake. He knows if you've been bad or good. So be good for goodness sake. You better watch out. You better not cry. You better not I've got to know what happened to the Grinch there. Something happened. I think he fell out of the camera. You better watch out. You be yes. He was so busy blocking off his ears, he fell over. I love that. For good, so be good for goodness sake. You better watch out. You better not cry. You better not pout. I'm telling you why. Santa Claus is coming to. Santa Claus is coming to town. So is Mr. Grinch. Santa Claus is coming to town. Frosty the snowman. Santa Claus is coming with me. Good. Hey Holland's family, it was... Oh my god, the way they finished that off was perfect. Every one of them had a little moment that just captured them so perfectly. I absolutely loved that, that was brilliant. Such an incredible pleasure working with my entire family and Jeff and Brian Hall on this. Check out their links down below. Yes. They are so incredibly talented and I'm so thankful that they joined on this one. This was something I've New life goal is to get a Brian Hull video on the channel because holy jeez Louise, he was amazing. But Jeff killed Mr. Grinch. I want to do forever, so I hope you enjoyed it. Patrons, I can't do this without your love and support. And if you liked this epic medley, you are going to love that one right there. So give that a look. Merry Christmas. Stay safe out there. Wasn't my kiddo amazing? He was incredible. Bye. He was absolutely incredible. And I love how proud Peter is of him. It, it makes my heart so, so happy. Um... But yeah, that was, that was awesome. That was everything I would expect from a Peter Holland's Christmas medley and more uh, because we had special guests which just took it over the edge. But taking, yeah, taking all that aside, I, I, I so want to see more of his stuff. This is, this is a conundrum I have. I want to see every Christmas song released by all my favorite artists and I've only got so many days in December. But uh, I'm so, so glad I got to see this one because it was incredible. Guys, as always, please check out the original video linked in the description. Give it a like and give it a comment. Tell Peter he's amazing. Tell Ashland that he's adorable. Uh, and subscribe to Peter if you haven't already because the man deserves the hell out of it. Leave me a like and a comment and subscribe to me if you haven't already. Also, check me out over on Patreon where I run these weekly polls. I also You also get access to the Discord where we have some of the most amazing people over there. Uh, I do weekly TV show reactions. You get a... There's a, there's a, there's a tier for a bonus reaction once a week that goes to my YouTube members and to my Patreons. So sign up to either of those for that. But if you sign up on Patreon, you also get my TV show reactions and you get to vote in the polls. So worth signing up on Patreon. Uh, I also do monthly movie reactions, a monthly live stream, and at the highest tier, you can get a guaranteed reaction right here on the channel. So check all of that out. I will see you all in the next reaction video. Have a great day, night, morning, evening, afternoon, whatever time zone you're in. And I'll see you next time. Bye.